Okay, I'll now bring up Tilax to the stage, please. Woo! Next. Yeah, we're in the intro. How'd you get the order wrong? <laughs> well, yeah, welcome back, guys. Um, hope you guys are all doing good. Just a little introduction about me. Um, about three years ago, I started making TikToks, and I started it because of a very bad reason. I went through a breakup. I was in a very shit place. And uh, oh, thanks, guys. Don't worry, it's fine. But yeah, I got over it, and I had to release my negative energy in a different way. Be more positive. So I decided to start making people laugh. I started posting TikToks online, grew a little audience. I've done everything in my room, everything. And here I am, performing again at a uni. I think that's sick, don't you think? Yeah. And yeah, um, to get into the jokes, uh, if you guys know a bit, of, a bit about my history, I like dark humour. I love it. Um, the thing is, dark humour is a bit, it's a bit subjective. Some people might like it, some people might not. It's very subjective. It's, uh, how do you compare it? It's like, it's like clean water in Africa. Not everyone gets it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. <laughs> okay, that was just to test the waters, but I think everyone's calm. Is everyone okay with that, yeah? Woo! I think that's I think solid. Okay, that should be fine. That should be fine. I'll sprinkle in some dark jokes here and there, don't worry. Um, but who here believes in astrology? No one, maybe. Yeah. Hi, bro, I had a sick line to like violate someone. Who believes in astrology? You believe in this? Yeah, it's fake, it's fake, it's fake. <laughs> I was gonna do a sick drop and you guys ruined it, bro. But yeah, it's calm. Um, the reason why I don't believe in astrology is I'll give you a good reason. I'll give you a good story. The reason why is because I used to have a friend. Remember how I said used to? I used to have a friend. And when, uh, when the topic of astrology came up, I was always like, um, they were asking me, like, oh, like, what star sign are you? And I was like, how about you guess? So then I made them guess. And this is how it went. This is how the interaction went. Are you an Aries? No. <laughs> Are you a Pisces? No. <laughs> Are you Sagittarius? No. Are you a Cancer? No. I was like, oh, tell me what it is then. I was like, I'm a Gemini. Ah, I knew it, I knew it. <laughs> <laughs> I like, shush, bro. Like, that's how I knew it was fake. That's how I knew it was all bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> I never believed in that crap, man. I never believed in it. But I can't lie, though. There is some stuff that astrology do say that is very true, you know. Charming. Handsome. I agree with that, you know. I agree with that. But there are some stuff like, oh, like, humble and stingy. Okay, maybe I'm a bit stingy. But I think every student is, you know, we got to save our money, now. Um, but yeah, um, I started doing gym again recently as well. Um, and the thing is, the new gym I joined, it has like, like normal features. So it has the gym, it has showers, it has swimming pool, it has everything that you need. The thing is, if for the guys, obviously. If you guys haven't been in a men's changing room, for the girls, I can describe it as a, as a function, and you know the table that has all the snacks and stuff? Imagine like the table where there's all mutter rolls there. That's how you describe it. <laughs> it is the worst thing that you will ever see in your life. I still remember this one time. I remember my boy, Amin, he knows us all, yeah? I'll tell you guys. I remember after gym, we went swimming, we chilled for a bit, and then we went to the shower. And obviously, I'm just gonna walk out about naked, you know? I'm just walking in with my shorts and whatnot. And a guy, I shit, bro, guys, I promise you, I shit, you know, a guy walks out the shower, butt naked, rolls hanging about, everything, and he looks me dead in the eye, and like, ah, oh, bro, bro, go to the shower, good pressure, good pressure. <laughs> bro, I looked him in the eye, and I walked to the next one. I was like, you think I'm gonna go there? Like, you dumb, like, what? It's so messed up, bro. But, yeah, man, like, gym is a bandage. You see all kinds of shit there. Like, honestly, like, I would not recommend it, man. It's, it's the worst. Gym, yes, of course. But if there's a change room, avoid that at all costs. Go home and shower. No, you're not safer there. Um, but, yeah, the, who here misses secondary school? Woo! Yeah, I think everyone misses secondary school, you know, when everyone didn't have debt. No one had responsibilities. You know, your mum just shouting at you, like, oh, why not studying and shit? But I'll tell you guys a little story about my, uh, about my secondary school. I had a chemistry teacher, and uh, his name is Mr. Chaudhry. I don't know if he's watching this, but if he is, then... Yeah, we well, say Mr. Chaudhry, good, yeah? <laughs> I'm violent, you know? <laughs> but yeah, uh, I had a teacher called Mr. Chaudhry, and he was the one teacher that made me enjoy chemistry. I never liked chemistry, okay? I, choose, I chose triple science, I've done physics, uh, chemistry, biology, you know the deal. Physics was always my thing, you know, like, I, I love maths, I was always good at it. Biology, if anyone likes biology here, yeah, I don't like it. Uh, chemistry was like, chemistry was alright, chemistry was alright, you know. But this teacher really made me enjoy it, really did. 
because um, he was the type of teacher that would like violate you, bounce with you, you know, have a chat with the students. It was good, it was good. But there was this one time where I think I was making a comment to one of my boys next to me. So obviously, he, the way he is, if, just picture this, imagine like a kinder right here. He's, he's bold, right? But he has a very, very strong beard. Uh, his beard can I compare? His son, I can compare it to your beard. Right? Very, very nice, strong, manly beard, you know? But you see the hair on top, it was not there. It was just bold. So, so this is him. And then obviously he was just teaching and stuff like that. And he has like a like very like very thick neck rolls, you know. And I took the piss out of it. I was like to my boy, like, yeah, but this guy's fat, man. Look at his neck rolls. He hurt me. Yeah. The thing is, I said about violations, right? This guy went in. This is what he said, yeah. I, I can't quote it word for word. It was quite a while ago. Um, but this is how it went. He said, Talax, I might be fat, but I can go to the gym and change that. You're ugly. You just have to live with it. <laughs> that was a violation. But the thing is, I, I can't blame him. Please, uh, could you pull up the image? Oh shit. That's me. That's me. Okay. Why are you blocking? Why are you blocking? What is that fringe? Please. Okay, that's not how I looked in the second row. That, that wasn't primary though, but I just want to throw it in there. But I liked you guys. You guys just said, oh, I'm nice. Alright, next one, next one. That's how I looked. <laughs> that was year seven. Guys, I was sure as shit. I shit, you know, look, look. You see that blazer, yeah? You see how, you see how long it is and how actually, I know it's not the best picture, but that blazer was the smallest one in the shop and it still didn't fit me. And I only grew into it about year nine. That's when I started growing. Until then, I was about, about this high. About this high. I was like three foot eleven. Like, I could be classified as a midget, honestly. Uh, pull up the next picture. I was always very skinny as well. I mean, I still kind of am, but that is hideous. <laughs> you're, you're lucky, I mean, I can't lie. You was, in the, you was in the side next to it. You was in the phone, so I was like, I don't violate you. Uh, <laughs> I was a twig and a half. And then the next one? Yeah. <laughs> guys, guys, be honest. What would you rate that trim? Out of 10, okay. Zero to 10. The louder you are, the better that trim is. How, how, how sick do you guys think the trim is? Whoa. Uh, you guys are blind as shit. But yeah, next picture. I just really said because I look good now. Yeah. That's me now, that's me now. I glowed up, yeah? You guys are in the gym now. Huh? What? The screen. Woo! Yeah. Come on! Woo! You guys are saying, you guys are saying, ah, oh, to that ugly picture of me, but you guys are shouting at these pagans, pagans. It's fine, it's fine, I'll allow it, I'll allow it. Um, the thing is though, at normal comedy gigs that I see online, I see a lot of comedians, they come up to the front, they try to violate people in the, in the crowd. But then again, I think, how can I violate the students here? Bruh, I'm one myself, what am I gonna say? Uh, like, we all go through the same shit in our life. We wake up, regret life, <laughs> be in debt, you know, eat sore curry, everything like that. <laughs> not attend our uni lectures. <clears throat> Obviously, I don't know about who, who attends or not. And as well as that, everyone depends on SFE. I'm pretty sure everyone can say that, right? Who here actually has a job outside of uni? Raise your hands. Okay, keep your hands up. Who here works in a supermarket? No. Tamils, man. Tamils, I'm telling you. <laughs> Just like Lakshan said, I work in Tesco's as well. You know, Tesco is it, it runs as a Tamil plan. I feel like it's just everything that everyone does. But to leave you guys off with uh, with my last uh, my last story, I'm gonna, guys, I'm gonna tell you guys a story of how I went to my friend's house. It was a guy friend, by the way, before you guys think of some witch here. <laughs> so I went to my friend's house. He moved into a new apartment, right? So he told me to make myself at home. That's what I did. <laughs> I kicked him out, because I don't like visitors. <laughs> <laughs> but another story was that um, his aunt died. Sad, I know, man. It was a bit sad, but I speak for laughing. <laughs> The thing is, yeah, the reason why she died was because when she was in hospital, no one could remember her blood type. It was kind of mad, no one could remember it. And she kept screaming, be positive, be positive. <laughs> Everyone was like, we are trying, man. we are trying to be positive. Unfortunately, she passed away. That's what he told me. I don't know how to break the news to him. That I think what she was trying to actually say was that, I think that was a blood type still. <laughs> but, um, before I left, I was just like, um, he, was, he was a bit upset talking about his aunt, right? So I thought I'd send, tell him a little joke. And um, I told him that, okay, this, this is how the joke went. So I was like, um, hey bro, I got a little joke for you. You just didn't lighten up the mood, you know? So I'm gonna say it now. What's better than winning 
our gold medal at the Paralympics. Standing. <laughs> the joke didn't sit well since he was also in a wheelchair. So. <laughs> As you can see, I just uh, rolled out of there, you know what I'm saying? I just, I just left, I left uh, Carla, I don't think I've ever talked to him again though. He's probably still rolling around somewhere. But, <laughs> but obviously, you know, I was talking to, who was it? I was talking to Lucky earlier, and I was like saying, Yo, bro, I'm gonna think a joke about the Paralympics. I hope you don't see there with that one leg missing. Yeah. That would have been awkward. Like, that would have been really awkward, but it's fine. But before, another, I just realized another thing before I go. Raj, he was talking about an old phone you had. You Where's my phone, though? Where's my phone, though? Yeah, that's what's wrong. Who has it? Where is it? Where is it? Yeah, it's over there. Someone's trying to get it. I've got a burner phone. I've got a burner phone. Stop, I'm making sure it's over there. Look, the ground will break. Just hold up that phone, everyone. Damn! That is old shit. That is old. Wow. By the way, you said back in your back in your time. How how back are we talking? <laughs> I refuse to comment. You refuse to comment. Refuse to comment. I'm gonna guess you're like 46. Then. <laughs> 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 the skin just looks good, then I'm gonna just guess that. But yeah, um, yeah, that's all for me, guys. Um, <laughs>